Today we have a special guest star. This is Simon Henry. Say hi, Simon. He's it's nappy time, so hi. he has to go leave to take his uh, second afternoon nap. That is. Or is it his third afternoon nap? Uh, well, it's only been afternoon for a little bit, so probably second. So he's gonna take his nap while we film this video. Bye, guys. I love you all. All right, baby, go take a nap. No? Come on, you can do it. I believe in you. Good boy. All right, guys, today we have a super special video. Kind of spontaneous, and by kind of, I mean extremely spontaneous. We need to, um, we need to start carrying a camera with us yeah. more regularly. Uh, long story is we're at the doctor today for me because I practically live there sometimes. Mm. And uh, Jason's like, oh, hey, this new cookie dough place is nearby. We should go. And I was like, but budget. And he was like, but cookie dough. And so there we were. <laughs> so today we... So cookie dough won out over budget. <laughs> yeah, well, I get to do finances later. Woo! -hoo! Today we went to a place called Doe Company. Um, or they for for more you know cohesiveness, it's Doe Co. They sell edible, safe to eat raw cookie dough. So any of you out there who are like me or Jason as a child and love to eat the cookie dough when you or your mom was making were making chocolate chip cookies, uh, this place is for you. And it's supposed to be safe to eat. So they do special things to both the eggs and the flour to make sure it's safe to eat and you will not get sick. So your childhood dream has come to life and it is here in St. Louis. And currently it is here on our table. Yeah, actually it is, not for long. Supposedly, <laughs> according to the person who sold it to us, it will last three weeks in the fridge. However, it will most likely not last three weeks in the fridge, if you know what I'm saying. So they gave it, they have like little sample spoons and they put a little bit of sample cookie dough on the spoon and give it to you. I think Baskin Robbins yeah, sample yeah. style. Yeah, so they, they handed us a, a couple of those and like even that was really heavy and you, you could, just fall in love. Yeah. Definitely don't need a lot of cookie dough. No. We did get four different kinds, but we're just going to give a taste and let you know what we think. Uh, and definitely not going to eat them all now. We're going to eat just a little bit because we did just have lunch. So hopefully we won't get too much of a sugar rush and then crash and then, you know. Anyways, we also have our milk here because we're those types of people that got to have some milk with our cookie dough. Also with our cookies. Apparently you can also bake these and make cookies if you're not a cookie dough fan. So lots of information. Yeah. And before we start, I just want to say one more thing to all of you out there that have been thinking, oh, I really want some cookie dough, or you've heard about this place and are like, yeah, I want to go get some and keep putting it off. I just want to say, don't, don't put it off. Um, this is a brand new place. It's very small. It's not a huge franchise. So just be aware that, you know, make sure you're supporting them with your time and money if you think that they make good stuff and that mm. it's worth it. Because if you're not supporting these types of places, then there may come a day when they're not there anymore and you missed your chance to try that thing that you wanted. So, yeah. you know, I totally understand needing to budget and save up. But just remember, you can only say you want it for so long. At some point, you gotta just go get it. And y'all gotta just go get some. Because <laughs> I tasted it and... Yeah. We're not disappointed. Yeah, not at all. Anyways, so I just wanted to put that out there that with a lot of these places, make sure you're supporting them because if you're not supporting them, they may not be there anymore and that would be super duper, super duper sad. Yeah. Yeah, because then you can always say, I want to try it someday, but someday may be too late. Yeah. All right, let's test it though and we can tell you if you should be going Did you tell them what kind you got already? No, I did not because now we're going to get right into the cookie dough. We did get one box of their bonbons. They're just three little, I would say bite size. They're like Jason bite size. Yeah. Well, I actually could eat this in like two or three bites. And it's covered in chocolate, icy, no chocolate, like a hard chocolate and sprinkles. Absolutely delicious. Good for a cute little treat. Would even be great for like a party or a gift or something. Yeah, absolutely. We're going to stick those in the fridge because we've already tried one and try to save them for our friends. Friends, no promises if you're watching. <laughs> we love you, but... If they're not there when you come over, sorry. <laughs> not sorry, but We sorry. love you, but we love cookie dough. <laughs> Anyways, we got four different kinds just to get a good range. We have the good stuff, which is their classic base. Just your typical chocolate chip cookie dough. We got it with chocolate chips. You can also get it without. The next one is peanut lovers. Yeah, that's a peanut butter base. So peanut butter cookie. 
with Reese's Pieces and Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. So just three different types of peanut butter with a little bit of chocolate. If you're like me and absolutely love Reese's, I'm sure it's gonna be. Good. I'm sure it's gonna be pretty. We'll fantastic. find out. Yeah. Yeah. And then we got the Buzzy Doodle, which I thought sounded really cute. That is a sugar cookie base, and it has cinnamon and white chocolate chips. So that sounds similar to Snickerdoodles, which is a uh, one of my favorite cookies that I had when I was young. And then we got the Turtles Dough. It's a sugar cookie base with sea salt caramel chips, pecans, and chocolate chunks. It was per recommendation from one of the employees. Exactly. There. They said it was amazing. And also, it reminded me of my mom because I know my mom loves turtles. So this one is turtles. for you, mom. We're going to taste it. My mom. I, I like turtles. turtles. <laughs> but like the chocolate kind. <laughs> Alright, let's get started. Let's start out with the cookie dough base. We're just going to take a small bite because otherwise... And by I small... I mean, you can comparatively. <laughs> that tastes like cookie dough that I make. That tastes like chocolate chip cookie dough. Like from your mom. Mm -hmm. I don't know about your mom, but... <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, the stuff your mom makes is supposed to be dear to your heart. Excuse me, sir. I went in for a second. Sorry. If one of us dies, you'll know why. <laughs> Ooh. I got a little bit of the peanut butter one on there. You cheated! I cheated! Ugh. All right, can I get the peanut butter one? The peanut one, pe the peanut one <laughs> is very creamy. I got a Reese's oh, wow. base in it. It is super creamy. Right? It's so soft. That was very peanut buttery. Oh, man. Yep. If you like peanut butter. Oh, man. You're going to love that. Absolutely. I feel like that one's not going to make it more than 24 hours. I feel like... There, that proves my point. <laughs> Alright, stop. I'm closing the lid on this one. I'm sorry. So, I can't help myself. Final thoughts on the classic chocolate chip and the Reese's. Reese's Absol peanut lover? Peanut lover. 10 out of 10 would eat again. Oh yeah, absolutely. Yeah, love 100%. them both. They, they taste really good. Uh, the chocolate chip cookie dough tastes just like chocolate chip cookie dough that yeah. I've made before. So it tastes... Homemade, delicious, amaze balls. Yeah, there's no. If you like peanut butter, the other kind is also so creamy. Amaze balls. Like, and then just a good blend of everything that's in there. Like, not overwhelming. And you get a decent sized scoop. Look at this. Yeah. That's one scoop. That's two scoop. One, two Are you scoop, ready? two scoop, three scoop, four. Okay. So these two, like, I'm not a fan of white chocolate. He's gonna get over it though. I'm gonna get over it. I so mean. we're gonna start with Buzzy Doodle. This is a cinnamon sort of cookie. <laughs> My English is so broken today. Mm. That tastes like Snickerdoodle. And I love me some Snickerdoodle. Where's this been all my life? Actually, there's a place in New York City, but we don't live near New York City. Mm. They do ship though. But I didn't feel like dealing with it yet. Then when I heard this place came, I was like, well, that's a godsend because no, this is what we've been waiting oh, for. Oh, absolutely. And the line wasn't three miles long like it is in New York City. And uh, the lady the lady that helped us out said that, that uh, this place was inspired by the location in New mm. York City. But I don't know. I don't know how good the one in New York City is, but I, this is absolutely fantastic. I don't know how the one in New York City can beat this out. <sighs> That's good. Okay, it tastes just like Snickerdoodles. If you've ever had a Snickerdoodle, it's a delicious cinnamon cookie without too strong of cinnamon. Mm. And I actually don't like white chocolate at all. But I think the white chocolate in this is perfect, and I don't mind it. I will definitely continue eating. And again, that dough is just so soft. Do you care that there's white chocolate no, in it? No, not at all. Yeah, see? It, not at all. That's, that's I mean, I'm a cookie dough ten. heaven. Yeah, I'm trying not to like eat too much at once though because i really don't want that sugar coma to hit it i could i could sit here and eat an entire box of this. but then you'd be full of regret i would be full of regret but i'd also be full of happiness and that's what really you know matters. what else though guys we have vanilla ice cream in the freezer yeah you see that face <laughs> this is why he married me <laughs> not really that uh, was a creepy laugh <laughs> <laughs> definitely wrote in a video though uh, okay so anyways if you have vanilla ice cream hanging out you know what to do. Come All right, this on. is the last one. Yeah, this is the turtle's dough. And again, so I, you're looking at caramel, pecans, chocolate. Jason doesn't really like caramel. I'm not salted caramel. He's gonna eat it anyway. I'm gonna eat it anyway. Not complain. Nope, no complaints. 
You don't hate it even though it's salted caramel. Mm. He's going in again even though he hates salted caramel. I'm telling you, I don't know why I keep gesturing with my spoon. Literally every other thing we've ever had that had salted caramel in it, he was like, no, I don't like it. Mm. He just went in for a second bite on this one. That is wonderful. Mm. It's quite good. Mom, you would like it. You definitely can taste the salted caramel and the pecans and the chocolate. You know why I'm doing all talking in this video? It's because he keeps stuffing his face with chocolate chip cookie dough. <laughs> Guys, you have to try this place out. Um, absolutely, everything that we tried is fantastic. The people there were really nice. Yeah, actually, there were two workers there when we were there. They were both very friendly, full of smiles, definitely good customer service. Um, All they really have right now is cookie dough and cookie dough products. So they have like cookie dough on top of brownies, cookie dough inside of cookies. Well, on top of brownies is nice. Right. Yeah. Uh, they, but they did say they were working on things like shakes and smoothies mm -hmm. and things like so that. So they like just opened a yeah, couple days ago. Like Wednesday we're gonna, last week. Yeah. Obviously, like we do with everybody, link their information down below so you can contact them if you have any questions. Uh, they're honestly, working on delivery right now, so they don't have it yet, but yeah, like they're working I'm, on that. I'm blown away. Like, it's quite delicious. When I hear cookie dough, I get really excited. Mm. Uh, and it can be really easy to let somebody down, but no, these are all delicious. <laughs> you know, I wish we were getting paid to say that, but no, we bought this with our own money. Yeah. But we love it. It will probably not last more than a couple days. So, no, hi, no. if you're a friend of mine and you're seeing this video. Make sure you come over soon. <laughs> Use news. Otherwise, you gotta go to West County Mall. Yeah, so if you live yeah. in the south area of St. Louis or the western area of St. Louis, it should be pretty close because it's in West County Center. Um, if not, it's worth the drive. Not yeah. gonna lie. Not we not. were in the area, so it was super convenient for us. Yep. And they're decently priced. I'm pretty sure one scoop One scoop is, is $4. $4, which, you know, isn't that bad. It's not much more than if you bought that many cookies or... No, not at all. Yeah. If for, you bought ice cream. Well, that, that would make a, a good sized cookie. Oh, you can also get it in a cone. It's true. Hello. Hello. I feel like we're rambling now. And our battery's about to die. So we need to wrap this up. There's really not much more to say, to be honest. Uh, we tried four flavors, but there were... Excuse me. Four other flavors that we have not mm. tried. If you try one of those, definitely let us know in the comments down below. Let us know what you thought. We might have to go back again and try those other flavors. You can Absolutely. also, you know, let us know if you insist that we do that for you. Like the 24-7? I didn't even read that one. 24-7 chocolate. Brownie batter base. With chocolate chunks. I, why didn't I see that? Hang on. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> I think she just swooned. <laughs> Whew. Anyways... <laughs> We're gonna go put these in the fridge right now, though Jason will probably go love on that peanut butter one a little <laughs> bit more. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next video, getting back to, you know, normal food after this normal brief interlude. Besides, you can't really eat ice cream in winter that well, like you can, but you're, you're really fighting forces of nature. Here we have the great alternative to ice cream for the cold winter months. Because you put everything in this stuff like you would in ice cream. Chocolate chips, chocolate, peanut butter. Chocolate chips. <laughs> Anyways, they also have toppings. I was gonna say that yeah. they have toppings, just like ice cream. Yeah, toppings, sprinkles, cookies. Guys, if you don't get it by caramel. now, go. Go, just go. Oh, by the way, it's in the food court in West County Mall. We had trouble finding it. We actually, Very back in the food court. We actually asked in Build a Bear, <laughs> and they told us where to go. Yeah. So that is all we have to, for today. Ten out of ten. Dough Company, Dough Co. If you are watching this, we are in love with you. So thank you for coming to St. Louis. Please don't ever leave. Please, Ever. please build one in North County. And we are definitely going to be following them on Facebook <laughs> for more for any updates, especially because I know this guy loves shakes. So when those come, <laughs> goodbye, my budget. Cookie doughs and cookie dough and shakes. Okay, we need to stop talking about this. We got other things to do. <laughs> I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I hope you're not too jealous of this delicious cookie dough in front of us because you can get your own at Doco. Yes, we'll see you in the next video. Have a wonderful day, guys. I was afraid of fear itself. It took so long to leave this shell. And yeah, I know I've been a little slow, but hey, 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 hey I'm good to go.
you think it's safe for kitties? No. 100% not because it has chocolate in it. Maybe they can make you some salmon cookie dough. You would like that, huh? That sounds horrifying. But not to Simon. He loves himself some salmon. 